Hi guys, look for Kate and welcome back to another FIFA 17 Legend review. Today I'm going to be reviewing the 88 rated French legend Patrick Vieira. Uh, I got Vieira for just around about 1.7 million coins and in the 6 games that he played with me, he got me 3 goals and free assists. I was playing him in a centre mids position in this team. Um, he has freestyle weak foot, freestyle skill moves and has the medium high work rates. So uh, let's now get into his in-game stats and highlights. Okay, so into Vieira's in-game stats, a few of the ones which stood out to me were his 85 ball control, his 86 short passing, his 91 strength, and his 94 aggression. Uh, feel free as well to pause the video if you want to have a look at those stats in more detail. His specialists were the playmaker, tactician, and strength, and his traits were injury prone and header and into the highlights that i got with Vieira, i found him to be a very good legend both on the attack and defense he certainly in these clips uh, you can see that he contributed to both of them i also found him to be a legend with a sentiment position where he played in my team he seemed to be able to control the game and the tempo of the match um and then combine that with his a good defense and his good attacking made him a very enjoyable legend to use in the game um his shooting was fantastic, definitely better than what it said on the card. I think it's 71 on the card, it felt a lot better than that. Um, also, he had very good dribbling and physical, so it was very good for him to kind of charge uh, through the midfield and defence to uh, sometimes get through on goal and score some great goals. Uh, sometimes it shows him just going through the whole defence and then being able to pass it through to uh, one of my other players to uh, score. And then a few of the other clips also show his good strength and his good tackling. Uh, I found him to be pretty good at that, but I thought uh, Vieira was honestly better on the attack than uh, the defence. So I would definitely recommend playing him at a sentiment position where you get to see a bit of both in the uh, in his attacking and uh, defence abilities. But into the uh, summary parts, I found his main um, cons to definitely be his shooting strength. Uh, also his work, Chris, I forgot to mention, because he was very good at getting up the field and then being able to track back. Uh, his cons was probably his passing. His passing was okay, but I thought it could have been better. Um, he didn't really, he couldn't really make long passes. I mean, he could do short passes quite well, but he struggled at making uh, long passes to my attackers, although that's something that I don't do very often. Uh, anyway, I just mainly play through balls in. So uh, overall, I was very impressed with Patrick Vieira, and I decided to give him an 8.5 out of 10. For 1.7 million coins, uh, he has gone down a little bit now, as well as gone down by about 50k or something. Um, I don't know if I'd recommend paying that many coins for him, but he was good, but I don't know if he's really worth those amount of coins. Um, I suppose it... He's probably worth about a million, but 1.7 million, I'm not too sure. I think there are other players that you could get, like Effenberg, uh, who could just who could do just as good a job as Patrick Vieira, in my, in my opinion. But anyway, that's going to conclude this Legend Review, guys. Uh, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys later.